Hey, what's good, YouTube? Nath Mass Collector back with the <clears throat> HGA reveal. Um, I got my first HGA shipment back finally. I actually have one, two, three, four, five, six total orders at HGA. Uh, four of them shipped. This is the first one I got back. And I believe these, and let's see which one we got here, but. Five cards. That's not really a bad thing. I'm gonna rip it open. Damn. All right, anyway, their boxes are secure. This one here, I sent them, they received it on May 11th. And this is a 30 day Turnaround time. 15, So basically 35, 38 days, business days. Um, obviously there was a, you know, Memorial Day was in there. So, you know, anyways, 35 days, let's just say, which isn't bad. Um, kind of what we kind of expected. So let's see what we got here. All right. I am pretty sure on these, I, you know, these are personal collection stuff. Um, I really, you know, wasn't looking for like the most perfect cards that I have, but these are, um, Ooh, this is a good one in here. So this one first is, um, is a Ken Griffey Jr. Um, it's the tops. 1990 glossy rookies card so i know I, I know it's not a perfect condition or anything like that but i really wanted to get it in an hga slab with a custom label these are all custom labels that i asked for um and i got an eight on this one so what i i put a note in all these orders on what i would have liked to see for a custom label and for this one here i basically i wanted you know, this type of look to it up here, which they put an American flag in there, which is cool. That works. Um, I was kind of hoping there was going to be some yellow in here to really match that card. But, um, you know, more of a simple, simplistic design, colors, things like that. But looks pretty good. Um, got an eight, which, you know, I'm fine with that. Again, this is a personal collection card. I didn't plan on selling this one. I just wanted to get it into a slab. And I, I, I've had this card since I was a kid. I mean, I pulled it out of a pack, a uh, rack pack, I think it was. So that's cool. Let's take it out of plastic here. And their slabs are sweet. Um, feel really really good crystal clear uh, the label the label looks really nice as far as you know it's cut well it's printed perfectly I don't see any issues with it at all it's not moving around in there the cards not moving from what I can tell uh, their slabs are solid all right. Uh, next one here is Dennis Rodman, the 2014 card from Crusade uh, Excalibur set. Uh, this is a Crusade Red, so this one is actually numbered out of 99. All right, let's see what we get here. So Dennis Rodman, this is number 28 out of 99. Um, we got 959599 for subgrip. Man, does that look sweet. And we got a nine on it. Okay. But man, that looks awesome. And I know what I asked for, you know, I put my note in there. I asked for, you know, can we get like this Phoenix design up here in the label? Or, you know, I and I did say, you know, use gold and black and red for everything in the label. And they definitely did that. So it looks good. I think it looks great. too bad though it was only one uh, half a point away from a 
And what I'm doing here, I'm just kind of looking at the spelling, make sure they, they everything spells correctly and whatnot. But man, this that looks really cool. <laughs> man, I'm a, that's that's awesome. That's an awesome card right there. All right, next one here is Christian Wood Blue Shimmer from this year's Prism 2020. So the Blue Prism is a number about a 35. Um, I actually have one that's centered a little bit better. This one's slightly off. You can kind of tell it's pushed that way a little bit. But, um, ooh, so we got 95, 95, 95, and a 9. And we got a 9.5. Man, does that look sick. Woo! Wow, does that look good. That looks awesome. Oh, that's so cool. I'm really happy with this one. I asked them, you know, on the on the label to try to mimic the shimmer look to it and the colors and everything. So they definitely did a good job with that one. But um, yeah, I'm super impressed with that. That looks amazing in a slab. And these slabs are sick. I, I like them. They they're really feel, uh, you know, heavy duty and super clean separation um, between you know the card and the, the borders all look good okay so this one here is John Collins this is a gold sensational signatures from this year's prism um, it's numbered out of out of 10 and I actually got this one on a break and so this is an autograph so the autographs a 10 so that's that's sweet um, and we got 9.595, so we got a 9.5. Awesome. And that looks really, really sweet. That looks nice. I kind of wish they would have put like some sort of uh, design, like this, this shape, maybe like up here as well but um, I, I like it I think it looks awesome looks good nice simple nothing over the top but uh, John Collins is a you know I collect his cards uh, this one here man this looks great so that's pretty sick on that one and the last one I got here is Giannis Onto Tacumpo's Net Marbles card from this year. Um, and I've seen their labels on some other ones that they've done, so I asked them for the same type of look on that. And let's see here. So 959599. I probably got a 9, huh? Yep. So got a 9 on this one, which isn't, you know, I'll take that. Love the label. The label looks great. This is the press proof. So this is a gold um, marbles card. Actually, I sent two more of these into them as well, just recently. But so I got a nine. That, that's cool. I mean, I was hoping for a nine five, obviously, but I think it had just kind of. Uh, um, yeah, I can't believe the edges. And centering, I mean, centering, I think they're all kind of like chopped off at the top a little bit, but whatever. I'll take a nine. I think it looks great. It's kind of a personal collection card anyway, so I didn't really plan on selling it. But yeah, I think it looks awesome. But I mean, overall, my first impressions on these slabs, these are the first ones I've got from HGA. Um, I think they look great. Um... Yeah, I don't have any uh, any complaints at all. I mean, I knew I knew the Griffey wasn't going to get the best grade just because it's an old card, and it was just something I wanted to send in and get it in a slab. And I think they did a good job um, with that one. Um, the Rodman card, man, I just love this thing. This thing looks great. 
and uh, Christian wood card just looks phenomenal in this slab. So cool. 9.5 on that and then you know getting a 9.5 on this one this was this was a, a great hit that I got on a break you know out of 10. Super cool and then the uh, the Giannis card again so um, yeah man I'm uh, pretty impressed with the whole experience so far I mean you know besides just waiting so long but I mean that's, that's what I ordered you know I got the a 30 day 30 day service and it came back in about 35 days or so so you know basically what was supposed to happen um let me know what you guys think um i'm pretty impressed by the whole thing you know i think they look just fantastic on these these labels and everything they did a really good job so i'm super happy um thank you guys for watching the video i really appreciate it uh leave a comment let me let me know what you guys think on these and uh, also, please subscribe if you have not yet. Um, that would be great. Uh, make sure you hit thumbs up, like the video if you did, and then um, hit that bell for notifications and you'll be notified of the next videos. And uh, we'll see you, see you in the next one. All right, guys. Thanks. Later.